Yo, what is up everybody man? It is Joji back with another video. So we can see in the title and thumbnail, ladies and gentlemen, today is the day we're actually gonna be looking at a brand new BMW M340i. So I just got all ready. We're probably gonna make our way over to the dealership. I'm very excited as I think this is like my first time ever really looking for a car technically, right? Like I've been to dealerships. But this is like the first, I would say, like series time. And I'll let you guys know if I see anything cool on the way. And yeah, I'm just excited to take a look at, you know, what's going on. I think it's raining right now, no way. But hey, we, we are not going to let that stop us, hopefully. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are now outside looking at the cars. I know we were just inside looking at a bunch right here. Hey, you can see me through the window. But yeah, this is a 330i. So as you guys know, we're just looking right. And this is low-key a spec I would go for. This Brooklyn, I think this is the Brooklyn gray color. That's what it's called. Let me know, if I had to get an M340 chat, here, hear me out. I think I would go for this color. I'm not gonna lie to you. I would go for this over the white just because it's not as boring, you know? I feel like white, white you can't go wrong with, right? But this, I feel like it's clean and I would go for the red interior as well. So I think if I had to get an M340, this is just a 330i for anybody wondering. But if I had to go for an M340, I would definitely go for this. And look, it even has the lip in the back. This is also the face lift. I think this is a 2024 or five. But yeah, it's nice, bro. That's like the same interior. We've just been looking for a little bit. But I like this one a lot, seriously. A bunch of other nice cars here too as well. Also, let's just get a fit of the day real quick. We got the Jordan 1, uh, what you call it? I'm forgetting the name, what the heck? I'm having a brain fart. Oh, the Obsidians. Okay, here's also another color I was thinking. This also has a red interior. This is a 230i, right? Wouldn't go for this. Nice, nice wheels though. But as we can see, 230i, I wouldn't go for a 2 Series. And if I had to go, I'd go for a 240i, right? But I'm going for a 340i. I just heard a nice M3 startup. I don't know if you guys could hear that in the background. But this is the other color. So let me know, which one do you guys like more? Do you like the Brooklyn gray? Or I think this is called like the skyscraper gray. Those are like the two colors I'm thinking on. I wouldn't, I don't know about why. I think Brooklyn gray is my favorite though. Not gonna lie, but let me know. Do you guys like this gray? So comment down below number two or comment down below number one if you like the other one. Here's actually them right beside each other. So comment down number, number two if you like this or number one if you like this. I think I like this one more. I'm not gonna lie. I think this one, just a little bit nicer than this one, just a little bit. So ladies and gentlemen, we have made it to the dealership. Now, as we can obviously see, this is a voiceover, but I literally recorded everything when I was here. I went over almost every single car, and yeah, there is such a wide variety here, okay, ladies and gentlemen? There was M3s, they had an M2, they had an M8, they had M5s. Actually, I lied, they didn't have any M5s, but they had a lot of good selections, and just take a look at this M3 right here, and obviously they had M3s. 240s m 340s m 440s and yeah i was looking at this m3 right here hey look you can see me through the window this thing was absolutely beautiful but as you guys know i'm not really looking for a g80 m3 just because i'm more focused on the m340 more in my price range and also i just feel like it would be killer to get it as a first car right so I'm most interested in an M340 right now if I had to get a BMW, but take a look at the XM right here. Obviously, I would be more interested in the M3s if I could get a good or like just a better price on it, right? Hear me out. But also with the G80s, these things are nuts. Like seriously, bro. Like dailying this, especially in the winter, as you guys know, or if you don't know, I'm also looking for a car I can drive all year round. And I just feel like getting a G80 M3 brand new as a first car would be kind of crazy to drive all year round right but i was looking at this m240 this is really nice but if you guys don't know i probably would not get a two series not just because i don't like the two series it's just that i want something that's pretty practical i feel like a two series would be harder for me just because you know it's a two door it's not as big as a three series but i literally love the two series i think they look amazing and this purple on it was beautiful absolutely beautiful color i like it i know some people don't like it but as we can see right here there is another m3 man this thing was absolutely beautiful. Like I said, man, maybe I would get an M3 in the future or I'd be more interested in one. But as you guys know, I'm looking for a first car, right? I've never owned a vehicle. I'm 17. I'd want something that I wouldn't be as like also scared to drive. Like I, I feel like I'd be a little worried driving this. Like I'm like, oh God, 
I gotta be careful, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, this thing is a beast. Would definitely love to own one at some point. And pay attention to the color on this car, okay, ladies and gentlemen? This is called Brooklyn Gray, if I'm not mistaken. And I'm very curious, would you guys like to see me get an M340 in this color? Because that's actually an option. And as we can see, here's a dark blue m340 and i was really wondering ladies and gentlemen what do you guys think is the best color for this car would you like to see a red one would you like to see a dark blue one would you like to see a white one black one gray one aka the brooklyn gray or would you want to see like a darker gray me personally my favorite colors for this car are dark blue brooklyn gray which is that one that was on the m3 and i really like white as well but i feel like i'm leaning towards the brooklyn gray the most as we can see they also had this beautiful m2 right here dude the price on this m2 is actually not that bad either i'll be honest with you this is used it has uh like 50,000 kilometers but the price on it is not bad but like i said i wouldn't get a two series or just like just because like i i i'd want bigger right i want a three series more but this is a really nice car. Like, I'm not going to lie. I really like the M2. But I just wouldn't I wouldn't go for it. I would love to have it. But I don't know if I'd go for it. And it is a competition. It's a 2020. It's used 50,000 kilometers. It's a good price though, that they had going for it. Then as we can see right here, they had an M8 competition. Oh, this thing was so crazy, bro. Not only the car, but the price. They also had a Z4 right here. It's just a 30i. Nothing too crazy about it. But very nice car. I wouldn't get a Z4. Honestly, I'd rather, I'd rather just get a Supra, but take a look at this M8 right here with the carbon bucket seats. Seriously, this is a crazy, crazy car. Let me know what you guys take, a Mercedes-Benz GT63 or BMW M8? Me personally, man? Oh, I don't know. That That is hard. I'll be honest with you. That's a very hard pick. But as we can see right here, this is another m340 and this is actually the other gray that i was talking about i don't know if you guys could tell i actually was sitting in this car later you will see but this is the other gray so do you like this gray the brooklyn gray that was on the m3 or do you like white i'm pretty sure we all know what white looks like right but this is the darker gray me personally i really like the brooklyn gray like this gray is nice too but the brooklyn gray was very nice and i will be showing you guys that later here here the m240 right here this or this is actually a 230i actually but this was the brooklyn gray with the red interior this is exactly how i would get an m340 if i had a spec one out i'm leaning towards the brooklyn gray i don't know it just looks cool it looks different i feel like it stands out and i feel like it's not like a boring color i know some people may count like white as like a boring color and whatsoever but me personally I feel like that car is a very nice color, but here we go. I actually got to sit in the M340 right here, as we can see. And I'll be honest with you, this interior is nice. As you guys know, if I got an M340, I'm leaning towards the facelift just because of the new screen and it just has better technology. And it also has the newer headlights, like just the facelift in general. And it also has a different shifter too, which is very cool. But here's how the car looks right here. Got like the infotainment system. Dude, this car was crazy. Seriously, take a look at that. Cup holders. You know, you get the point. Just like an interior. And I was also like controlling the screen right here. Dude, this was fire. They also had this nice M440. The price on this was pretty good too. But like I said before, I feel like I'm leaning towards more of a uh, 3 Series. In my opinion, I kind of do like the look of a 3 Series more than a 4 Series. Let me know what you guys think on that. This car was very nice though. Take a look at the M badge on the side right there. The wheels look so nice, like the all black with the white. But yeah, this is what I'm talking about right here. So this is like the white color. So would you like the Brooklyn gray? Would you like white? I know it's obviously not a 3 Series, so you can't tell as well. But dude, I think all these colors look good on these cars. Like there's not really a bad color, you know? But I'm leaning towards more of the Brooklyn gray. Let me know what you guys think. As we can see, we got like a V8 right here, obviously in the M8 competition. Then you got the M2 competition. I wanted to take another look at this car because like, dude, it's actually a nice car. You got like the blue stitching on the seats. There's an infotainment system and everything right there. Very, very nice car. I cannot lie. And then, yeah, I had to take a look at the badge one more time. M2 competition, baby. We like that. And then M8 competition carbon fiber on the lip beautiful all right ladies and gentlemen we are now leaving the dealership this has a, been a pretty good time you know they got a lot of good cars here we've been looking and now it's time to make a decision think 
what <laughs> what I like the best, right? Because there's a lot. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about the M340s. I think it's such a very nice car. Ladies and gentlemen, it is now the end of the day, pretty much. Well, I still need to stay up and edit and do some stuff. But as we can see, it's currently 1 a.m. And as you guys know, went to the dealership earlier. It was amazing. I just ended my stream for anybody wondering. And this is the outro for today's vlog. Let me know if you enjoyed it. I had a lot of fun today. It was honestly just amazing looking at the cars. And let me know if you guys would want to see more videos like this. Currently on the look for a car. So maybe expect more like this because honestly i would like to go to more dealers just to see what's going on with all these other brands as you guys know we only went to bmw but maybe maybe i might dip into some other dealerships and see what we're working with because like i said in my other videos i'm not picky when it comes to a car so comment down below what you guys think i should get and yeah i'll see you guys later hit that like and subscribe button turn on that post notification bell to never miss any videos like this and other than that i will see you guys in the next one and go watch this video where i show you guys i found this dodge demon for 300k it was nuts anyways peace bye